welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about my favorite nail products. I'm going to start off by talking about my favorite nail care products and later I will talk about my favorite nail art products. So first off, I would like to show you my favorite nail wax. This one is by a German brand called Trend It Up. It is a really nice product with a lovely sweet smell and I use it normally like once a week. On a close second place, I have the Bird Bees Cuticle Cream. I don't use it that often anymore because of the smell. It has quite a strong lemon smell, so I don't use it like at school or something. The product I use the most is definitely my nail oil pen. It is filled with pure jojoba oil and you just simply twist the end of the pen which makes it super easy to carry like in your bag to work, which is cool. And I use it every day and apply it on my cuticles and at the underside of my nails as well. My favorite file is a glass file. This one is by a brand called File Ring. I really like this one because it has a super long lifetime and it files really fast and effective. And it does not cause any splits to my nails, which emery boards do cause. So now I'm going to talk about my favorite base coat and my favorite top coats. My favorite base coat at the moment is by Essence. It is a whitening base coat, which works great to make your mani last longer and also prevent your nails to get yellow stain caused by pigmented nail polishes. On second place, I have this base coat by Trend It Up. It is a rich filling base coat. It dries really fast and it also makes my manis last longer. My favorite peel-off base coat is by Maybelline. It is a great base coat. I use it for glitter nail polishes and I use it under gel polishes in order to make it peel off really nice and no, don't damage my nails. My favorite top coat is definitely the one by Catrice Cosmetics. It dries super fast, but it does have quite a thin formula, which means it can cause smearing on nail art designs. That is why I also own a no smudge top coat. And my favorite non smudge top coat is definitely by Moyu London. I use it a lot, so it is almost empty, but I still really like this one. And after I applied it on a nail design, I usually go in with my quick dry top coat. My favorite matte top coat is by Starly. This one is called Matter. And this is an amazing matte top coat and it works on any polish and it dries super fast. My favorite quick, uh, my favorite non-wipe top coat is by Masura. It is, a, uh, it is a Russian brand and it works great with nail powders and it cures under any UV lamp or LED lamp. Now I'm going to talk about my favorite nail art products. First off, I always use a cleaner brush if I paint my nails because I'm not perfect at painting my nails, of course. This one is kind of funny because the cap is like super long, even though the actual brush is kind of small, which is pretty weird. But still, I really like this one. It's nice and soft and it does the job really nice. I used to use the cleaner brush from uber chic a lot but i dropped it in a bottle of nail polish remover so it's not really usable anymore because the outside looks really bad the bristles are still okay but not as good as they used to be my favorite detail brush is by born pretty store as well I did trim it a little bit to make it even more narrow. I also use tweezers all the time to peel off my liquid latex or peel off any nail vinyls. This one is also by Born Pretty Store 
and I really like the design of this one. And last but not least, I have this clear stamper, also by Born Pretty Store, and it works really nice on curved nails like I have, because it is square and it is see-through, so it, it is super easy to see where you place the design. So that was my list of my favorite nail products. I hope you also have a favorite by this time. I also have no oil pens for sale. If you're interested, feel free to send me a DM by Instagram or send me an email. They retail for three euro and 50 cent each, and that is excluded shipping. And for now, I would just really want to thank you so much for watching and please subscribe to my channel and I hope to see you next time. Bye bye.